Hello friends, this is DMC um, and this is my quick review of Fraser's Coffee Roasters Steel City Blend um, Coffee Beans and a big thank you to Fraser of Fraser's Coffee Roasters for sending me these coffees and in the box there was a quick card that said Hi, I am Fraser, I am a sole coffee roaster from Sheffield It is my passion to bring customers a true coffee experience from around the world all year round. I have been roasting delicious fresh and quality seasonal blends since June 2014. All my coffee is batch roasted giving me complete control by tasting, cupping, profiling. I ensure I produce consistently great coffee. And there is all contact information there for Fraser's Coffee Roasters. And I'll add um, links in the description below for anyone who is interested in checking out the website. So let's take a look at the pack. And Fraser actually mentioned that this is one of his top sellers, this coffee. Um, so that's, I, I left this one to last because I, re I had a feeling that I was really going to like this one because it's a dark roasted um, coffee. So there we go. Fraser's Coffee Roasters. Steel City Blend, roasted in Sheffield, 250 grams this bag, and it is a blended coffee, and on the, the label it says, the taste notes are bonfire toffee and maple syrup, the origin is Brazil Santos, and Indonesia Java, six years, I'm not quite sure what that means. Um, the varietal is Bourbon and Java. The processing is washed and dry. And the cup quality score is 70. So it seems that the darker roasts seem to get a lower cup quality score for some reason. Um, I'm not quite sure why. So if anyone knows, let me know in the comments below. Um, roasted, dark... Whole beans, um, expired to consume within four weeks for peak freshness and this was roasted on the 10th of July 2018 and the expiry date is the 10th of December 2018 and as I say I received this pretty soon after that 10th of July date so really good on delivering um, quickly um, Fraser's Coffee Roasters and more contact information there and as I say, I'll add the link in the description below. And that is it for the pack. If we take a look at the beans, well, as you can see, fantastically oily, dark roasted beans. They've almost, not quite, but almost got that sort of fishy smell in that I tend to pick up when I am um, smelling dark roasted coffees especially when the oils have um, come out of the beans and um, with the, the dark roast the aroma as I say it's fantastic wow um, it's dark sweet with a really strong caramel aroma <clears throat> excuse me it's chocolatey and smoky too I'm really looking forward to trying this one as this is the type of roast that I really really enjoy um, but as I say, really nice, fantastic looking beans then. And really dark as you can see. And when ground, the aroma is exactly the same, um, but much more intense. With maybe a slight spiciness that adds a warmth um, to the aroma. It's quite a pungent aroma to this coffee. Um, you can smell it a mile away. So, taste-wise, it's sweet, chocolatey and smoky. It's smooth with a nice bitterness that not that's not too overpowering. But it does surround the mouth. Um, the sweetness really comes through with a sort of treacle hint. This is a fantastic espresso coffee, I would say. It's able to handle plenty of milk without diluting the flavour or taste. So it's perfect for milk-based drinks like cappuccinos and lattes, etc. 
it leaves a smoke uh, it leaves a wonderful smoky sweet aftertaste too that I really enjoyed. Um, it's full bodied, big, bold, and brash, and just the way I like it the, the majority of the time I would say. So this is definitely my favourite coffee from Fraser's Coffee Roasters, and it gets a four and a half out of five from me. If you like dark roasted coffees, this is a coffee you'll really enjoy. And it's a fantastic blended coffee too with the types of beans that I really sort of look for when I buy coffee, which are Brazilian and Indonesian Java beans. So as I say, fantastic, wonderful dark roasted coffee scores 4.5 out of 5 from me. So I'd like to hear from anyone who's tried this coffee or any of the other coffees on offer from Fraser's Coffee Roasters. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more coffee reviews in the future, subscribe to my channel. That was my quick review. Thanks for listening. Bye for now. Oh,